Hello, hello everyone. I'm Ashley Angelique Rivera. I am Orpheline Pamplena. And I'm Althea Jeline Amistrera. We are here to explain the seven commandments. You shall not steal. That is the seventh commandment of God that forbids unjustly taking or keeping the goods of one's neighbor and drawing him in the way with respect to his goods. It commands justice and charity in the care of earthly goods and the fruit of men's labor. For the sake of the common good, it requires respect for the universal destination of good and respect for the right to private property. Christian life strives to order these great goods to God and to paternal charity. Bakit nga ba ito mahalaga? Ito ay mahalaga para sa mga tao dahil ang pagnanakaw ay isang kasalanan na dapat iwasan at huwag tangkilikin. Huwag kang magnakaw ng hindi mo pagmamayari para lang makamit ng isang bagay sa pamamagitan ng paggawa ng kasamaan. Pero, bakit yung mga tao pa rin pinipiling magnakaw? Kahit nakasad na sa ikasampung utos na bawal magnakaw. People are tempted to steal because they can and will never be contented sa kung anong meron sila. Laging kulang, laging may hinahanap. Kahit sapat na, hahanap at hahanap pa rin ng rason to justify na kulang iyon. Reality is reality. Minsan, hindi maiiwasan ng tao na magreklamo sa dami ng gastusin at sa taas ng biliin. However, it is still doesn't give anyone the right to steal. Hindi pwedeng lahat ng yaman sa mundo ay mapapasakamay ng isang tao lang. And that's great. People must always be thankful for their job or business. Maaaring hindi kalakihan, but at least nakakatulong ito sa kanilang pamilya. Learn how to be contented for what you already have. Strive harder kung gusto nating umangat sa buhay. And second, God is our ultimate provider. Walang duda. Hindi pa natin hinihingi o sinasabi, alam na alam na niya ang pangangailangan natin. The problem with people who engage in stealing is that they can't wait for God's timing. Nagiging mainipin kasi ang iba. Kaya kapag hindi nakuha ka ng gusto, sa madaling paraan na lang idinadaan. Life doesn't work that way. Kung ganoon na rin lang, mababaliwala ang essence of trusting and having faith in Him. Just pray and pray. God listen to our prayers. Hindi man dumating kaagad ang inaasam nating maganda at financially, stable na buhay. Trust that it will come that he will do something about him. Let him take control.